Hey guys, welcome to a brand new video on the Professor's channel. In this video, I'll show you my keyboard cleaning routine. You can do this for mechanical keyboards, for gaming keyboards, and for any other keyboard with removable keycaps. I like to do this every month or every other month, because keyboards can get pretty dirty, especially when you've been gaming on them or typing on them for a long time. I'm going to show you a way to safely clean your keyboard in a very thorough way. It's going to be a deep clean. Uh, you'll need a mechanical key puller. I'll put that in the description down below. And you'll need a small bucket to put your keys in because we're going to wash them with soap. So I'm not here to waste your time. So let's dive right into the video and I'll show you how to clean your keyboard thoroughly. All right, guys, the first step in cleaning our keyboard is to pull out all the keys that are on the keyboard. Grab your bucket and key puller and start pulling all keys out. If you don't have a key puller, you can still pull out the keys with your fingers, but that makes the process a bit more tedious. Throw your keys in the bucket after pulling them out and make sure you don't lose any keys. I would also advise you to turn off your computer. I couldn't turn mine off because I was recording sound of this video on it, but you will be pressing all sorts of keys and stuff will appear on your screen. So uh, yeah, you might as well just turn it off. After pulling out all the keys, grab a vacuum with a bristle end and vacuum your keyboard. Be careful doing this, only the bristles should touch the keyboard and not the hard plastic end. We don't want the keyboard to get damaged. If you don't have a vacuum with a bristle end, I would not advise you to use the hard vacuum end. Just grab a brush and brush all of the dirt from your keyboard on the table and after that vacuum your table. Then grab a wet wipe, make sure it's not dripping wet and start to go between the grooves of your keys. This ensures that you clean any sticky stuff which might stay on your keyboard. Alright, now we can head over to the sink. You will want to wash your keys with lukewarm water. Adjust the water temperature until it feels nice and warm to the touch. Then fill your bucket with warm water and add some soap. I used regular hand soap which will do a pretty good job in degreasing and cleaning your keys. Now that we have a nice bucket filled with warm water and soap we can start washing our keys. Start mixing the water and soap with your hands and rub over the keys in the bucket. This will clean the keys really well and depending on how dirty they are repeat this process. And if your keys are really dirty, let them sit in the water for about an hour. Alright, once you're done washing your keys, it's time to rinse them. You can rinse with cold water and repeat the rinsing process a few times. We uh, really do not want any soap residue on the keys. And after you're done rinsing, drain the bucket of water as much as you can. This will save some time in the next step. Okay, it's time to head back to the desk. Grab a towel and empty the keys on the towel. Wrap the towel around the keys and start shaking really hard. Make sure the towel has no gaps. This will allow your keys to dry much quicker because your towel will absorb excess water which is on the keys. Next, you'll have to leave your keys to dry for a while. When your keys are dry, spread them over your desk and flip them around so you can see the letters and numbers. Open an image of your keyboard on your phone or computer and start putting back the keys. Keep your towel closed so you can wipe any moisture off of your keys. Pop the last key back in and give the wrist rest a nice wipe and we're done. Alright guys, so we followed all the steps to clean our keyboard and my keyboard looks brand new again. I would advise you to do this once or twice a month because uh, it really gives a nice and clean feel to your fingers. And just to be hygienic, you, I mean keyboards can get dirty from sweat and all kinds of stuff. Uh, I hope you liked the video. I hope the video was easy to follow. Let me know if, you're, if you will clean your keyboard and uh, how that turned out. Uh, just remember, have a key puller, have a bucket so you won't lose any keys and uh, make sure that you uh, use some nice soap so your keys will be fresh and brand new. Um, thanks for watching. I hope you liked it. If you liked the video, hit the like button. If you liked uh, the content I make, then subscribe uh, to keep up with all the videos I make. So uh, thanks again for watching and I hope you have a nice day. Bye bye.